Agape. July 21, 2019. Interviews figures. So, before I start, I repeat for everyone that, when I say Agape Chandling, there is no entity. I simply situate myself at the junction of being and non-being, maintaining consciousness at the edge of its extinction, and the words come out. So above all, do not look for intellectual meaning, it is, above all, the aspect of igneous fire and vibrational fire that is the most important. I am therefore in a lying position, as I have already explained, to put the body at rest, and therefore an effortless proprioception of this rest of the body, which therefore allows me to settle more easily at the limit of being and non-being. In the heart of the one, present in the heart of each one, may peace and the joy of freedom shine forth in your person, may the song of the soul resonate and shine in your ears, may the heart of the one give the rhythm of freedom, of the gape, may each cell of this body in which you live, sparkles and twinkle with the same truth, with the same intensity. Silence. And in the unconditional acceptance of the truth in the heart of the one, any reticence, as well as any violence done to yourself or to any other person, is transmuted. In the heart of one, everything is resolved and softened. In the heart of beauty, each one recognizes itself, thus reborn in the truth, which cannot be said, which cannot be understood, but simply accepted as evidence of life, and as evidence of love. Where nothing can hold you, no framework, no reference, no limit, no logic, where simply is what has always been, immutable, the source of all life and all movement. In the silence of the heart of the One, the truth awaits you. In the silence of the heart of the One, everything is true, everything is authentic, where nothing can miss you, where nothing is superfluous. Truth is joy, truth is lightness, truth is smile, a truth that can only be lived and that is recognized. In this, you can only know yourself and recognize yourself. In this, the freedom of the person, of being and non-being is lived, gathered in the same dance, in the same silence, where everything is recognized, as coming from you, and being you. Where peace is everywhere, bringing its resultory balm on everything that may have suffered, on everything that may have been divided or separated. Silence. Each breath and each minute, passed in the illusory dream, leads you with majesty and strength, in this ultimate unique and first truth, where nothing can be missing, where you recognize yourself. Every circumstance of your life, whatever you think or say, is there only for that, for the one truth of the one heart. Where nothing can be divided anymore, where nothing can be afraid, where nothing can be dense. You are the unlimited, within this limited body and consciousness, accept silence, accept love. It is not only your view, it is not only your gift, but above all, beauty and happiness, you can only find yourself completely. This is your nature, this is your essence, and this is your home. In the heart of each one of us, you find yourself, in the same hellenes, with the same intensity and the same happiness. You are invited by the one heart to be the sweetness of love, and the sweetness of truth, that of the innocent child who is not yet impacted by the order and disorder of life in this world. In a gape, everything is purity and everything is lightness, you just have to see no distance between the truth and yourself, in order to live that this distance is illusory, simply built by the faults of history, and by the faults of this world. You are invited to a permanent smile that even death cannot interrupt. You are invited to laugh at the meaningless laughter of the lightness found and the evidence lived. You are your friend and you are your beloved. You are your source of living water and truth, which never dries up, and which quenches every thirst, fills every gap, and eliminates every imperfection, by the law of grace, and by the acceptance of this truth that you find, and which never could forget you. Silence.
a gate resounds in each of your cells, singing the same praise of the song of the resurrection, for you are born again, born again in truth and born again in beauty, where nothing in this body of flesh can now limit or restrict this freedom and beauty. Let yourself be carried away, let yourself be carried away by the joy of authentic light, in the heart of the one who is your heart, and who is the heart of each one, where the same joy pulsates, and where the same truth is once again revealed. In a gape, you cannot compare anything, you cannot choose anything, you cannot decide anything, and you can be free, from this freedom to know other, that nothing in your world can approach, define, or image. The time of history is the time of your history, and the time of bliss, where you no longer need history, where no scenario is useful, and where only the constancy of beauty sets you in the infinite present. Where nothing happens, where nothing can come, because everything has already come and everything has already been lived there. You are invited to be light-hearted, ignoring what your character may say. In this you can only accept yourself, in this you can only find yourself, in this is the whole. This is true humility, which plays no role in this world, and whose only function is to spread from one place to another and from one place to another, proclaiming the good news, which no one can ignore, and from which no one will want to escape, once it has been established on the whole earth. Where you are whole, everything is perfect, everything is clear. Each of your cells of this perishable body sucks in, vibrates and dances it, like a tingling and a twinkle, penetrating you in various parts of your body. Where every minute that passes in illusion puts an end to the very illusion of time. In the agape of the heart of the heart, there can be no distance, nothing can be opposed, because agape has no opposite, because agape is complete, as you have always been, even in what you are playing right now, which is only the score that takes you to this apotheosis. Silence In the heart of one, which is the heart of each one, is lodged your own heart, source of life and place of life, without separation and without distance. Where you rejoice in joy, without object and without yourself, where everything is a celebration of the truth lived, of the truth installed, at the very heart of illusion. Silence I speak in silence, where you can only hear it, where you celebrate every moment of life. Never again are you separated, never again will you be able to divide. Where nothing needs to be confronted, because everything is fused together, by the same joy and lightness. Let your heart of flesh dance the dance of freedom, and the dance of silence. Where you can't remember anything, where there's no desire, except the evidence of the moment. Everything is easy, everything is perfect. You are that first of all, first of all dream as in every dream, it had simply been forgotten, out of distraction and habit. You have invited yourself to live these moments and instants, through your flesh, through your history, as through all that is false, as through all that passes. There is joy, there is accuracy. Were at every moment present in the heart of each person, with the same equality, where your smile, your gaze, your thoughts and your words bring the same dance into the heart of the other, and the same resonance that becomes the same evidence, the round of life, where nothing can be connected, and yet everything is connected. Where there is only one, the one of the first dream and the one of the final instant, within the illusion of the dream and the illusion of lack, separation and division. Silence. Then the heart of man beats in unison with the heart of the source, in a symphony unknown by the sounds of this earth. The time has come, the time has come, the cycles have been completed, the path has been completed, you know every stone, every turn and every detour, you have traveled every attraction and every lure, and this path, which seems to bring you back to where you have never really moved, has been only a pretext, to finally remember, what is not of any memory, nor of any progress, nor of any history. 
I invite you to smile. The one who does not respond to any cause is the smile of the truth of the one who is fulfilled, beyond all expectations and all hope. It has always been there, it has always been made you forget, and you wrote the forgetfulness yourself, in order to remember the one truth, appearing in the ultimate of creation, and in the ultimate of the chaos of the earth. Where death and birth can no longer be sustained. Where what is false can only dissolve in this crackling of love. Silence. Where doing so no longer makes sense, and where the only meaning is being, touching the non-being of the unspeakable happiness of the abode of supreme peace. This is the breath of the spirit, who now blows from everywhere, and, above all, on the dust of your person and your history, your memories and your sufferings, for love wants you to be free, even within this perishable body. And whatever your world says about it, and whatever your laws say about it, and whatever anyone says about it, no word can define a gape, even if it is defined by the head, for only the heart recognizes it in its intelligence. Silence. You have been the way, the truth and the life, where you no longer need a way, where you're all life, putting an end to all suffering and insufficiency. The heart of the one calls you to joy in every possible way, so that you release what you think you hold, so that what does not hold you, does not hold you anymore. Be unrestrained in the freshness of the instant, which does not depend on any other instant. This is where you truly reside, in the abode of the ultimate, you are you, the eternal and absolute I. Remember the origin of the path, remember the origin of the breath, remember your first word slash verb and your first oath, the one to return to the truth, in the heart of each one, in the heart of the one. Silence. At the heart of acceptance, and at the heart of bliss, are consuming all the veils of illusion, all the layers of suffering, and all the offenses against grace, such as the gift of love, such as the gift of agape, such as your only truth. Silence. Let me set you on fire with the invigorating breath of the fire of the spirit, the igneous fire of truth, that is the balm of consolation and also of restitution. Silence. And in this silence, the choir of angels appears. It is also a celebration of the end of separation, and the end of illusion. So you decided, long before you took shape, long before you forgot it to find yourself better, to celebrate yourself better, and to embrace yourself completely, ignoring any density, ignoring any lack. This is the gift of grace, you are the gift yourself, and you are the grace yourself. Silence. Let the smile take you to the heart of the unspeakable, to the heart of your essence, let the good news fertilize each heart in your one heart. Silence. So is agape, so are you, so are you whole. You are the truth on the march on this world, wherever your steps take you, wherever your eyes look, whatever your lips say, the same joy and peace are imprinted in every heart. You, unspeakable joy and truth, you, who created all forms in the game of creation, in the dream of lack and in the nightmare of separation, you wake up because it is for you the right moment, and it is part of what you have written, long before you can leave it, long before you experience it. Remember what you had decided, during your journey, to bring yourself back to the truth, by yourself and for each other. This is the living of truth, this is the living of freedom. Recognize yourself in the instant of the present, where your presence is also the absence, where your presence is, I am also. Listen to the dance of your sacred heart, carried away by the igneous fire, and swarmed, in this world as in any world, spreading the good news to all dreamers.
Then the song of awakening can be heard. Silence. And there, in this peace and silence, let's bloom what emanates spontaneously, without effort and without will, the unspeakable love, which nobody can give you, and no thought can even touch you, and yet your flesh recognizes as just and true, that no emotion can bring you, that no feeling can approach, and yet you experience. Such is your unspeakable love, such is your unspeakable presence, transcending and piercing every form, every veil and every opposition, from wherever they may come, the same beauty can only take hold. Where smiling is the only weapon, is the only demonstration. Where everything stops fighting and everything is missing, because there you're authentic and fully yourself, beyond your identity, beyond the worlds you have traveled and dreamed of. There is your fullness, there is Helene's, it is never past and will never pass. Listen and hear me, at last I hear you, in order to live it, in order to give yourself as you have given yourself without taking anything away, and without adding anything more. Rejoice in the good news, it is for you, whatever you may think of it, no thought can be maintained in the evidence of who you are, no trouble can be maintained. Let yourself be consumed in the fire of grace and joy. This consummation, which is a caress of love, that no hand can accompany, but that only the heart can dance. Where you can only open your arms to each brother and each circumstance, without ever making a difference, and even less distance. That's what you are, everything else passes, your desires and passions, that's what you are, without any frustration, and without any question. Allow yourself to love yourself at the height of the unspeakable, allow yourself to accept yourself unconditionally. You are that laugh and you are the joy, whatever your character tells you, even if your life has shown you the opposite, it was only a pretext to get there, and to live that. Hear yourself and finally, understand yourself. You are the transparency and you are the intensity of a gape. You are as vast as creation, as vast as every creature, as vast as the universe is by standing there, at the heart of being and non-being, at the heart of your heart, ending distance, ending what is flowing. And there, everything is perfect, without anything to perfect, without anything to seek, just to enjoy it, beyond any reason as well as any body, which can never be interrupted, which can never be restricted, the enjoyment of a gape, which fills you everywhere and in all ways. Through the very opacity of your body, your transparency is found, your evidence is found. You no longer need garments, you no longer need ornaments, or even justifications, but simply to be, in everything being as in you. Then you will dance the symphony of angels, you will rhythm the symphony of love. It is now, if your now is in the here and now of your present instant. Embrace, embracing yourself, do not set limits, there are no conditions, except in your thoughts, if not in your prejudices. Accept yourself, you are freedom, all your stories have only been part of your dream that you accepted and created, to allow you to be true, to allow you to be there, here and now, in this passing body. Forget what you lived, it wasn't real life, it was just the dream of life. Real life is here, in the heart of the one, which is the heart of everyone. And it is simple, so simple. So be as simple as that, don't look anywhere but inside your heart, which is not to look for, which is just waiting to be found. In the heart of the present instant, I am what you are. In beings and not being, I am each of your joys, I am each of your sorrows, your dreams, and I am the balm you apply, in order to erase all the scars, which have only been in the dream, which have only been a passage, which have only been a pretext for the greatness of the present instant. In this, you are whole, unequivocal and without question, you can only agree. You are the gift and you are the grace, and the gift of grace cannot be refused, it can only be recognized, in the heart of the present instant, in the heart of the one, in the heart of each person. Where silence shouts, I love you. Where silence cries out to you, you are the love of each one, you are in the love of each one. 
Where this silence tells you your beauty. Where silence tells you the only truth. Silence. Accept yourself, as you are right now, as you are, as nothing of what you were and as nothing of tomorrow. Let yourself be impregnated by the gift of love. I deposit these words in the silence of your heart, they will spring from it as soon as you accept the dance of love. They will resonate in you every minute and every moment. Silence. Where I am, you can't miss yourself. Where I am, no lack can be sustained. Be generous with who you are, be confident in who you are, and especially not in what you seem. In this you are true, and in this you are whole. You have nothing justify, neither to yourself nor to anyone else, but simply to accept peace, joy and love, and what you are. Whatever your story tells you, even on this day, it was only a pretext so that you would never sleep again. Silence. And you'll love yourself with equal love, and you'll love yourself with equal love for everyone, without reflection and without condition, without attraction and without repulsion, in the nakedness of the instant, and in its majesty. I greet you, in the truth, I greet you, in your beauty, I greet you, by the fire of your heart, I greet you, by the seal of the truth. Agape you have been, agape you are, boy and agape you will be, beyond all world is beyond all consciousness, and beyond all form. You fulfilled your dream, you fulfilled all your dreams. You can't miss yourself anymore. I now remain silent, and I leave you, in this silence and this dance, engraved in your heart. In the heart of the one, in the heart of life, you are blessed. Through Jean Luca Young. Les Transformations. English Translation. LMF.